This is Hello Glass with another Glass Artist interview. What is your name and are you a glass blower? My name is Ryan Higgins. Yes, I'm a glass blower. How long have you been blowing glass and you consider yourself a master? Been blowing glass 17 years. No, I'm not a master. Your favorite style or type of glass to create with? A boral silicate. Flame working. What state do you call home for your glass shop? Um, New Jersey. Do you own or work under a glass brand or an art name? Yes, Down Nick. And I'm at um, Facebook um, under Down Nick and um, Ryan Higgins at RyanHiggins.net. You can find some of my glass there too. Do you make your living solely off glass wine? Yes. If you could blow glass with anyone living, who would that be? Mm, my girlfriend, Abby, who doesn't blow glass. <laughs> Great answer. What style or technique of glass is hardest for you? Oh, um, intricate detailed line work, uh, intricate pattern work. Name two people that taught or influenced your glass skills. Uh, Mylon Townsend, um, I learned a lot from him, um, and Maurizio Catalan from Italy, not a glass blower, has influenced my glass blowing. Is there any style or technique in glass that you would or will learn in the future? Yeah, I've done some castings, so I wouldn't say I've learned it, but I'd like to learn more about it and do more of it. Name two glass artists that impress you. Hmm. Glass artists that impress me. You know, um, anyone doing, like, I mean, Yushin's work is really impressive because of all the pattern work. Um, other people who do stuff that I just have no idea how it's done. Um, there's a guy named Punty doing stuff right now. I have no idea how he's doing it. It's amazing. So, yeah. What style or technique of glass amazed you when you first saw it? Can you repeat the question? What piece of glass, when you first saw it, amazed you? Oh, um, pipes by Jonathan and Clinton back in about 94, probably. Worst injury you ever got making glass art? <laughs> Well, actually, I was making a piece, I was making a snail that had a, a shell similar to this on it, and the punch is attached here, and you have to force this shell piece to your other glass piece, and the punty broke, stabbed me through the web of my two fingers while it was hot, and snapped off inside my fingers, and I had to drive myself to the hospital with my hand up like this while the blood broke down. Oh, ouch. <laughs> What do you wish to accomplish in the glass industry? Oh, um, make a living, leave behind a legacy of artworks, and make a lot of friends along the way. Have fun. How does a glass fan get a hold of your work? Um, they can contact me through email, through Facebook, any, any way. What's your email? Um, downneck at ryanhiggins.net. I generally don't sell retail so what I'll do is you can contact me and I will get you to another uh, distributor or retailer in your area perhaps an online retailer or a local retailer either one. Nice. Do you have a Facebook? Facebook is down neck. Nice. You've got three minutes to tell the world whatever you want go for it. <laughs> well basically what down deck is all about is what I've been doing for the past three years I suppose and it's some ongoing series, maybe I'd say. Um, they are characters that are like cartoon characters. They almost always have one signature eyeball, but not always. Um, but what's really important about it is gesture, movement, clean lines, vibrant colors, um, how glass works with light, and that's what it's all about. And, and also just sort of with a, a silliness and a cuteness to it. And, that's the paradigm I follow when I make glass. That's awesome. This was Hello Glass with another Real Glass Artist interview. Thank you so much for your time.